as a kid, driving into the city, seeing the city skyline was had held this amazing magic for me. And so to me, Baltimore is magic. It has this wonderful appeal. I love Baltimore. I go into communities all across the city. I'm careful where I go at certain hours of the night, but Baltimore has pockets of remarkable culture and shopping and dining and it's it's a lovely it's a lovely town. It's part of the Hamden landscape. When the New York Times wrote about Baltimore, the picture they chose what, was what? the pink flamingo. There you go. They're fun hun. It was really just made to be a temporary Christmas decoration. It was never meant to be up there for years. People talk about John Waters and pink flamingos and things like that. Pink flamingos in Baltimore City existed before John Waters. They gave John Waters the inspiration. They're everywhere. And they're all different colors. It started out a tiny shack, real little, just a wedding gift for them. And they didn't know whether it was going to be a snowball stand or a beach stand. <laughs> I'm glad it came to be. <laughs> so this on the wire, they actually came here to eat. Normally, basically a line out the door all day, every day. Jeremy, what's going on with fried gravy and a small baked bean? We are with that. Sometimes them barbecue sauce like to drop out of our hands. A lot of places around here like to do gas. That's not grilling. I thought maybe you were driving by and saw the line. <laughs> or two can sand made you follow your nose. As soon as we got out of the van, you could just smell it in the air. People come from all over the world. The King of Jordan was here. Uh, ever since we had Guy come in, Connor's driving and dies, man versus food, 101 tastiest places to chow down. Like, we're on the map. I love Lexington Market. It's one of those hallmarks of Baltimore. I try to get down to Fadley's to get a crab cake because I know that Nancy still makes the crab cakes, every one of them. And it's a really awesome crab cake. Quote the Raven! Never more! Did you think I'd forgotten you? Perhaps you hoped I had. What is a hun? Oh, we call it a term of endearment. Hi, hun, how are you? It's just like, sweetie. And then there's the domino sugar sign that illuminates the sky downtown. You, know, you drive by it late at night, and there it is in the sky. And it's like, wow, we live there.